the Freedom X remote panel. Used to control the Freedom X inverter and Freedom XC inverter charger. To use the panel, press the power button. After a brief delay, the display will turn on. The load is indicated by the light bulb icon and the battery is indicated by the battery icon. The diagram has arrows that show the current flow from the battery to the load. You can view the different meters by pressing the scroll button. When inverting, the main screen shows the battery voltage and load wattage. The next screen shows the load side AC voltage and frequency. The next screen is the inverter firmware revision. The last screen is the remote firmware revision. When plugged into shore power or a generator, you will see the flashing AC icon indicating AC power is present and the unit is qualifying AC. When the AC input has been qualified, you can see the current flow coming from the AC through the transfer switch directly to the load. AC power is also used to feed the internal battery charger to charge the battery. The main screen shows the battery voltage and charger stage. The next screen shows the battery voltage and battery amperage. The next screen shows AC input amperage and AC output amperage to the load. The next screen shows AC input voltage and frequency. The next screen shows inverter firmware revision. The next screen shows remote firmware revision. Whenever the panel is illuminated, press OK for a few seconds until you can see a zero zero in the middle of the screen. Press the scroll button to scroll through the settings. Settings can be changed by pressing the OK button that shows the value in a flashing pattern. Short presses of the scroll button increases the value, long presses decrease the value. Press OK to accept. To exit the settings menu, press escape. Refer to the adjust features settings section in the owner's manual for the different settings and their potential values. Note that the Freedom X inverter, XC inverter charger, and XC Pro have different available settings depending on the model.